Hello, this is Daniel Zana. I had made a video, but um, my um, um, audio seems a little wrong, and my voice was silenced. So. Um, first of all, I am doing this vlog because today I have been harassed and cyberbullied by the NSA. First of all, all four of my Facebook accounts are blocked. I can't wish, you know, some people, including Rail, um, a happy birthday tomorrow because I'm completely blocked. Um, so I wish them a happy birthday through this video. Um, <clears throat> secondly, uh, the reason why I was blocked was because you know, I was updating my website, and I spent like about two weeks on it, um, you know, making it look better and all that. And um, <coughs> I shared a link, and I got blocked from Facebook for sharing a link to my website. They first had a problem with me uploading my artwork there, and now they're having a problem with sharing links. What the fuck, seriously, people just are so completely alien and drunk only. And then number two, my Twitter account was hacked. Obvious. Um, another thing, what I was going to say, I just wondered, wondered is it because of me telling you, warning people that, you know, because I wasn't feeling, I wasn't feeling well because I had a stomach bug. And um, I was invited to go and protest in Manchester. And I said, um, I warn people that um, face recognition software and precognition software will be used. I just don't, I haven't had anything. Um, to be honest, there's not much covered in the media about it, except for um, Russia Today News, BBC and Sky News. Absolutely nothing about the credit. It's just about we just had the conservatives dropping their jaws with it. So, um, um, uh, should I have gone? Should I have gone? I don't, yeah, I wasn't feeling really right. I had a runny stomach. And, um, if I went, I'll probably run into the toilet all the time. So, um, so I left it, and I warned people about it. I, I don't know if that got me to, as a target, um, uh, all, all of a sudden, or is it because um, other things regards to its terrestrial. Now, first then I've basically found out I was, um, my Twitter was active. Then, going on to YouTube, now this is weird, really bananas. On top of my my homepage, you know when you when you go log into YouTube, the, for your front page, which is where you see your subscriptions and what you watch and all that. There was a question: Do you like Earth? Yes or no? Well, that is a vague and stupid, pathetic question. Um. It's a yes and no answer for me. There are things that I like about this planet, and there are things I don't like about this planet. It's like Marmite. Earth is like Marmite. You love it or you hate it. Um, the thing is, um, the problem, the things that I don't like about it is this political bullcrap that's making this planet a living hell. Um, that's what I don't like about this. The stupid spying, the the cyber antagonization, cyber antagonization that I've received from Facebook and Twitter and all that. That is what I don't like about it. And then stupid ignorant people in the street who go and ask me what the you know what is my gender in a sense. Um, that's what I don't like about it. And the way they, they make the way people um, treat me and my artwork has been disgusting. 
I mean, it's basically um, cosmic culture in a sense, and most and um, it's a whole religious ideology enforced by the political religious religion elites. If you want to, um, let's say, um, this is what no what it's it's bloody stupid. This is what they want. They want to. Uh, put my word, create a genocide and then eliminate 90% of the people on this planet. Who gives them the right to create, create genocide um, to preserve um, the, the, the animals and plants and things? Who gives them the right to create genocide when they themselves created the problem in the first place with religion, politics and all that crap. Who gives them the right? Are they are they fucking special or something? No, to be honest, um, they're the ones that are the disease to the The religio political elites, some people call Illuminati, some people call them the Cabal. Um, I call them religious political elites because that's what they are. They believe in superstitious bullshit, and they 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 use they rely on money as their their ways and means to implement the authoritative abuse on the rest of the population. These people is what make Earth a dislikable place to live in. They, they, they use money and all that, and, and you know, if Nikola Tesla was accepted, this plant would be um, much better, to, a much better place to live in. Um, the thing is, like, I just don't get how the thing is, they want to do this genocide. Now, they do it by, you know, Really stupid stuff, and in the say in the process, they they the kill, they eliminate the nature that they want to preserve, the plants, the animals, and all that, and they they do this, um, and then the, and then what happens is this place becomes a barren wasteland. And they're like, oh, we're not gonna live on, we're gonna have to eat and all that. Um, everything's radioactive, and, um, what should we do? Oh, we should build a spaceship on the earth or somewhere else out of the solar system. That's what they would have to do, because they've screwed up this planet. And, so they go and they build this super spaceship, and they, you know, with all the technologies they've had under their asses, they could have made this place a better planet. A, a, a utopia. You know? So they could build the spaceship. And then all the extraterrestrials come and say, no, 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 no. What are you doing? You can't leave the solar system. Because, look at your home. You need to tidy up first before you leave the solar system. You need to fix that plant. You screwed it up. Um, we give you the opportunity to, to fix it, re terraform it, make it back like it was, and you know, try and get every single person back along the day. Which is basically impossible um, in a sense. Uh, to these religious political, so they'll basically be stuck here forever until they die. And then, what happens after that is another story altogether. But, um, no, that's the that question was rather stupid. Uh, it doesn't, didn't provide an option where you would say yes or no. And then provide a reason, um, because that is just a a daft question. And seriously, I, I honestly 
think that their question was put there on my page. Um, I, I suspect that was put there on my page because um, the fear, well, they know that I have extraterrestrial relationships. Um, and it's all fear, fear mongering, saying that if I can't know, then they will think uh, my people will invade. Um, or any other extraterrestrial will invade. Um, if I click yes, then I think, oh no, yeah, this, this, this person, um, she likes Earth, and um, well, let's try and conform her to our ways and things. I'm um, seriously, I do not conform. I do not conform to bullshit. Because I think I am. Um, I, I just here yeah, to let you know to make a place a better place. And seriously, number the last thing, please stop harassing me. Please stop deleting my artwork. Learn from it. Learn from my artwork. You know, learn from it. Not delete it, not destroy it, because that's that's what um, idiots do. That's what people who can't think do. They they, they panic and they're, oh, it's disgusting. Oh, yeah, 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 we don't like it. Let's get rid of it. Let's burn it. Let's destroy it. You know, everything just you know. This is what I don't like about Earth is everyone wants to destroy shit and blow crap up and kill this and kill that and you know. You know, I really, you know, I should have been doing, you know, I was going to be doing art this evening, starting a art when this is, I finish my website, I get into some artwork, no, 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 um, uh, I honestly don't feel up to it at the moment, because of this crap, anyway, um, see ya.